Hi, it's Anne here from Domez Blicity. I'm just about to do my fortni fortnightly grocery shop and I'm doing things a little bit differently today. I found it really difficult um, to buy um, reasonably priced meat um, at the supermarket and I'm going to do a bit of a bulk meat shop at a local uh, butcher shop because I've got a bit left over in my $150 budget for the fortnight because I don't need much in the line of pantry items I still got quite a bit there so I know my supermarket shop won't be high so it's going to give me a bit of money um, left over to buy some meat so I'll um, come back later and I'll show you what I bought I'm back from doing the grocery shopping and I'm just going to share with you what I bought now first of all I started off at um, a separate from the supermarket uh, butcher shop that specializes in some bulk meat so I got a kilo of um, shortcut bacon so it's not very fatty and it's lovely and lean I got a uh, boneless pork roast and that was only um, $7.99 a kilo the bacon was um, $6.99 a kilo and then I got a beef blade roast which was only $9.99 a kilo and I'll cut that all up and dice it so that um, we've got lots of stews and casseroles and beef for curry so there's quite a few meals in that and then I went to um, Coles as usual and picked up more potatoes three avocados on special for five dollars bunch of bananas a whole cauliflower some salsa for um, nachos eight liters of milk some lasagna sheets just to add to the pantry some corn chips for na nachos that we haven't had for quite a while and it's an easy meal for um, a weekend some tortilla wraps which i normally get bread rolls for hamburgers two loaves of bread self-raising flour uh, dog treats for the dog that were on special uh, underarm deodorant for my husband and myself a home brand pizza for my son um, tonight um, because my husband and I ate a big lunch so my son's back tonight and I just thought I'd get him that uh, some ice cream cones for movie night some ham frozen chips frozen oven chips uh, my usual green mixed vegetables, a tub of sour cream, my usual um, Greek style vanilla bean yogurt which I've been having for breakfast, two kilos of sausages or nearly two kilos of sausages, chicken breasts, a block of cheddar cheese and a bag of uh, grated cheese. So all in total the meat came to 41.48 and the groceries came to 114.76 and now uh, according to my calculations that's about 156 dollars so I'm just over my um, fortnightly budget of 150 dollars but I've got lots and lots of meat now so the next grocery shop Will be quite low I won't have to worry about meat and I'll probably have to um, dig into other accounts to top up on milk and or bread and vegetables next week um, I'll just see how we go and that's my uh, groceries for this fortnight thank you Hi, um, in addition to what I bought today from the butcher and the supermarket, I was lucky enough to get a bit of an overflow from a friend of mine's grocery haul. She um, picked up a grocery hamper, which was really good value, but there was quite a lot of things in it that she said that her family wouldn't eat and would I like them. So uh, I have got also this fortnight a big bag of baby spinach, half a bunch of celery, lots and lots of oranges and mandarines, um, an avocado, 
just going from memory, there was some um, sparkling mineral water, some um, yogurt, uh, individual yogurt serves, some um, bakery items, um, and some pantry items. There was a, a tin of pumpkin soup, a uh, which would be good for a easy meal or a uh, base for a casserole or a curry or something. Some jalapeno peppers, a box of granola, and um, yeah, I think that's about it. Just a whole lot of um, bits and pieces, and I'm not um, afraid to say no to uh, people wanting to give me things they don't need because I'll def definitely use them up. So um, I've also got a few extra things for free this fortnight. Thank you.